Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today's gonna be a short video because uh, I found a product I wasn't expecting and I had to tell you guys about it. It's it's so cool. It's this little guy right here. Believe it or not, I mean, I've got several of them, various sizes, but they all have something in common. It has this short, rubberized handle. This is super cool. And the bristles are extremely high quality. So when you're cleaning electronics, they don't leave behind traces, remnants, and at the same time, they're fine enough that they get around components and they can com they clean in between components, which a lot of brushes don't do very well. In fact, some of them are a danger because the brushes themselves, the bristles, want to pull at components, which means that you could end up breaking a board. Let's go ahead and take a look at this guy and where I found it. All right, so this is the mysterious brush, and I was looking it up and I googled uh, short handle rubberized paintbrush and I found it right here it's Wooster and they sell them at Home Depot but uh, this was given to me along with several others in a toolkit to which I might be giving that toolkit away but uh, what a cool brush for getting in and around components and cleaning things out and it doesn't lint and leave behind bristles which is such a huge plus. And like I said, a lot of circuit boards and stuff, the components are really sensitive to being flopped around. Some of those capacitors and stuff, these bristles are kind of fine. You can see that they're a very fine point. It's a signs of a good paintbrush. However, for dusting stuff off, these are some of the best brushes. And you can see up here, they have a whole collection of them. Now I recommend the shorter ones, like this is a two inch wide, rubberized handle so you can get it into places quite easily and you don't have to worry about the hard handle hitting things right it's soft which when you're in with a hard handle brush you might be hitting components inside a device this one here it's isolated it's rubber and yeah it's got it's got a uh, metal piece right here but you can see how I use the brush my hand normally sits right there my thumb my forefinger and when you have to clean things like fans, this is the brush that I go to. So cool. So anyway, that's the Wooster. And you can see they have a whole collection of them. Just make sure you get the rubberized handles. You can see it's kind of flexible. And it stows so nicely in a tool bag. What a cool brush. Anyway, guys, go check it out. I will leave a link to the one that I found in the video description. And uh, let me know what you think. I really appreciate good cleaning brushes because cleaning... It's such a large percentage of our job, if you're doing it correctly. Thanks for watching, guys. 